buzz in the changing room and um, the boys are really excited. You know, we, we talked about being bold and brave and, 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 and having a night of celebration as a group. Um, you know, we've we got people going on a couple of weeks leave now and, and others joining the, the Six Nations and, and people in our group who are in the, in the Wales Under 20 Six Nations. So there's a lot to celebrate and, and uh, we just said, Let, let's go and enjoy ourselves and, and uh, make sure we win the moments and, and, and they should add up. And sure enough, they did and, and uh, we, we're really excited. The early stages, I think, probably showed potentially um, a little bit overplaying. Um, I was charged down. It's a shorter field, soccer pitch, so um, slightly shorter field, particularly between 22 and the halfway, and uh, or in 22 and the 10 metre, and and you get a, you get value out of the chase. So um, they put pressure on there and got the charge down, and the next time Steph Hughes got a, a, received a kick off like that, he put it back over halfway. So um, shows that the boys learnt quick. And then we, we had a quick line out that put us under pressure, but it was just showing intent really. And we set up and um, watching it as a coaching group. Well, the boys will work it out and. And slowly started to work it work our way up the field and, and and put London Irish under pressure. You know, the tries came from really good rugby and exerting territory and, and possession pressure. And we probably left three or four out there that, that didn't come off. It looked like they were coming straight off the training field. So the work that the boys are putting in and the coaching staff are putting in was um, was a pleasure to watch at times tonight. And you know, just enjoyed the set piece. The scrum was outstanding, and so too was it was the defence, which created a number of turnovers that we then played off. It's uh, going to be outstanding. Um, what a challenge and uh, what a magnificent opportunity to go and, and play against an outstanding Toulon team who have qualified first and, and deserve a home quarter final. And um, what, a, what a great place to go and, and, uh, and experience that again. Um, our fans are outstanding tonight, travelling up the M4, um, singing loud and proud, and, and, uh, and probably outnumbered the London Irish supporters here tonight. And uh, we're, we're hugely grateful for them and you know what I love about our fans is that they they, they support us and support the game they're not uh, vindictive against an opposition and, and, and wanting to uh, see mistakes and errors they, 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 they're rugby fans and, and, uh, and they're certainly touring fans and, and, and love a good time and, and long may that continue. Oh look of course we, we, we're, we're, we're um, are confident of our ability whenever we take the field. Um, obviously, we're, we're going to be playing an outstanding side, and but it's a, it's a fair while away, and we don't need to worry too much about that. I think what we'll what we'll do is um, really enjoy this and uh, enjoy the next half hour or so together before before we split off and, and do different things for the next couple of weeks. But um, uh, look, we, we <laughs> we'll uh, we'll take anyone on, but uh, it's it's just a, just an awesome night to be to be a, a scarlet and a, enjoy the moment.